the unbeaten run goes on, but it's now four draws out of the last five. Is that in any way a concern for you? It depends which way you look at it. I mean, uh, yes, I mean, the, the critical eye in me wants more for us. We, we want more wins. We want to try and win as many as we can. We know these games are important. The positive side of my brain also looks at the uh, consistency that the players have shown and the fact that you know it's very easy to lose these games and you never know how valuable these points can be. We could have buckled, you know, because this place here at the moment is on top of it. The, the way the crowd is and they got off to an incredibly good start. Uh, but we played well today and, and we deserve to get back in the game and we, we performed much better than we have been. So uh, lots of pluses for us. Yeah, so yeah, West Ham did really mm. well. I mean, on his even, it's probably a quite yeah. an even a game overall, but probably a more valuable point, perhaps, it was. I could say, uh, for West Ham. And a lot of that was down perhaps to the performance of Aguero. I think it was only yes. his fifth game, but he, he, he was exceptional, wasn't mm. he? He was, 30 million from Wren, a uh, Moroccan. Played very, very well in the World Cup, and I thought that mm. what he'd done today was... You like to think that, yeah, he, he should have done what he was doing, but like I thought that he was quite impressive. You know, he, he didn't let anybody get really past, get past him. He was right in people's faces. You know, he was, he was there to, to mop up all the, all the problems that they were causing. If they were trying to go over the top, he's showing great pace, good positional play. Mm -hmm. You know, I thought he'd done, uh, he'd, done, he'd done that very, very well. And this was, uh, this was brilliant for me. I think Super. Callum would have been a bit disappointed, didn't get a crossing, but he got back fantastically well there. He really did. You know? and, uh, and again, you know, just covering there, just covering a bonnet there and just, just seeing it out. I thought he'd done very, very well today. And he was one of the reasons why they probably got that point today. I thought Declan Rice was superb as yeah. well, actually. Yeah, he really very was. Very good. So four draws in five Premier League games, um, Alan, for Newcastle, with just two goals. Is that cause for concern? Or? No, not really. We've got yeah. two, we, got, I, we got two in the semi-final, so we're in the final, so it's all right. Yeah, but this is a Premier League <laughs> programme, Alan. Yeah. I know that, I understand that, yeah, but <laughs> fourth in the league, not complaining too much. It's been yeah. an unbelievable season. Yeah. You're still confident? You were saying this morning, yeah. when I came in this morning, you were saying we're going to win the league, we're going to win the league, <laughs> particularly when Arsenal lost. Yeah, you did say that. It was just, I was excited. Yeah. I was still yeah. on a high from it, 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 Serious, serious question, though. The lack of goals a little bit is, a, is, is perhaps the one side of the game that you think... Yeah, because, I mean, what was happening early in the season with Almiron, he was, he was practically mm. scoring from every yeah. every angle. That sort of dried up now, and mm. Callum gets his, uh, his, his goal tonight. Mm. There are others that have got to sort of chip in a little bit more to, mm. uh, to add goal to that team, absolutely. It's not a huge concern. OK.